stuffy tutorial. Um, today we are talking about slip knots. So whenever we have a project obviously we have to start somewhere and the two main ways um, that we start our, our crocheting is with either a slip knot generally or a magic circle. So today we are I'm using my Phil's Odyssey hook. It's a three millimeter. Um, I have fairly severe arthritis so this is the hook that I prefer. Um, and as for yarn, we're going to use these little cute balls of katona. Let's go with the purple. Um, it is number 520, lavender. Um, so when we have our upcoming Mr. Cal, we will be using katona. I just think it shows up really nicely on camera. Really easy to see the stitches. Um, but I would love it if you guys could comment below uh, and let me know like what colors you think would show up best um, and give me feedback on the video so that I can improve them um, uh, you know so that they're better quality um, I'm new to this so um, the more feedback the better so yeah we're starting with slip knots um, so the first one I'm going to show you is just with one finger so we've got our short end I'm just going to hold on to that there pinch it I'm going to go over twice come back around, pinch them, those two together. You can see we've got two strings on our hook. Oops, yep, two strings on our hook. We grab the one from behind and he jumps over and then we grab the back one and he goes all the way over. And then we have our slip knot. I'll show you a few times. So we can put our hook in and the short end should tighten that. Now, if you're going to chain and you find that you've made your slip knot too tight, you can grab the long end that attaches to the yarn and then that will loosen it. Okay, so let's do that a couple more times. So we're holding onto the short end, wrap over twice, pinch the yarn, so we've got the two on our finger. So he jumps over once, and then the back one jumps all the way over the finger, and there you go, we have our slip knot. So short end, we'll tighten it. Let me do it this way. One last time. Okay, so short end, wrap around the finger twice. So we've got two on the finger, Let's pinch it. He jumps over once. Oh, didn't quite make it. He jumps over once, and then the back one jumps all the way over the finger. And we have a slip knot. Okay, so I'm going to show you another way as well. Like you'll find what works for you uh, when you're getting started out. Like just pick the one that you think you know sort of speaks to you that you that you'd like to do, and you just got to sit there and practice until you have it 100% mastered. Like this is the very first step if you're a beginner. So this is with two fingers. We're going to make a cross. Come back around. We turn our hands over. Get our hook. It slides under, grabs this. Just put your finger on top, pull your fingers out, and pull on the two strings. In this case, it's the long end that we tighten. Okay, so when you do it that way, the long end tightens and the short end loosens. So let's do that a couple more times. Okay, so we make a cross. Slide over across, let's do that again. So short end, make a cross, hook under, turn over, 
we get our hook, he comes in, he grabs the back one, just pull it over, put your finger there to hold it, and then you're just gonna pull. So once again, it should be the long end. It tightens, yep. And the short end that loosens. Okay, do that one more time. Okay, so short end, we're just going to hold that, make a cross, turn our hands over, get our hook, he's going to grab the back one, just hold it there, pull your fingers out, tighten. Okay, so that's the second way. Now the last way I'm going to show you is just the way that I do it. Um, it's not the clearest one to sort of show, but this is just the way I've always done it. So I just make a, a loop like that, as you can see, short end, long end. Twist it, I put my thumb and my finger through. I just grab either of the strings and then I pull it through there. If you pull the short end, then the short end will be the one that tightens, if you pull the long end, it'll be the long, it, the long end that tightens, okay? So I'll do that a couple more times. Alright, so I've just got, as you can see, a loop. I just twist it, put my thumb and my finger through, grab the short end this time, pull it through. Hook in. So that, because I used the short end, that's the bit of time. We'll do that one more time. So there you go. We see we've got the short end, long end. Just gonna twist it, thumb and the finger through, and then grab. Oh, messed that up. Let's have another go. Okay, so we just twist it, thumb and finger through, grab a string, and pull it up. Okay, well that's our basics on doing the slips, uh, the slip knot. So um, yeah, thanks for watching. And uh, as I said, please um, give some good feedback so that I can improve the videos. Um, hopefully this is helpful. Um, we've got lots of great stuff coming up. There'll be plenty of videos um, uh, getting everyone ready to partake in the Misty Cal. So keep an eye out for those. Make sure you like and subscribe and give us a big thumbs up. Thanks guys.